goodness, with face, pat, and tiz. And I was looking at my, I was looking at the cl the clock real quick, man. I see it. it's time, man. It, it, it's it's time, it's time, man. I think it's time, man. I think yeah, it's man. Time. It's time. Oh shit. It's yeah, it's time. Right. It's time, man. It's been too late, man. I thought shoot, it's time to go. All right. Episode 36. <laughs> <laughs> Episode 36. Good and fuckery. Good and fuckery. Da, 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 da. <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, so I want to start it off with uh, rest in peace, Biz Marquis. Uh, hey, man, the rest in peace. The uh, past, no, um, like about a week ago now, and um, I'm gonna just go say my quick, my quick um, feelings about this, and I'll let it go. But y'all got to stop claiming people are dead before their time. <laughs> Oh, it's, 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 yeah, it's, they be killing it's, folks they die so bad. <laughs> like y'all want to be right so bad, y'all wishing death indirectly on people, and I don't fucks with that. That's the fuckery I don't fuck with. Big facts. All right, now, that's it. That's all I had to say. Stop it. Y'all no did it with Bitters. Y'all did it with DMX. Yep. Shit, you did it with a couple of other people. Like shoot, y'all did it with people that were still alive. It was still. And still kicking that. Oh man, say that. Be confusing me. I'm looking emotional in my timeline. <laughs> and I'm sharing it because you got I got me I crying for no damn me. reason. Then when it happened, I done cried out all my tears. Next thing you know, somebody <laughs> comment. Uh this was found out to be untrue. <laughs> Whatever. Got Facebook flagging me because I felt sentimental. Yeah, man. Stop rushing to the wrong, to the to be first with the wrong shit. Yeah, it's definitely def ain't nothing you want to be the first to report on. Yeah, it's in the way. It's in the way. But I'm going to tell you what's not in the way. All right. Ah, uh, in the good state of our, our good home state of Virginia, they are righting some wrongs. And um, uh, the Virginia County um, in Arlington uh, voted to rename Robert E. Lee Highway uh, for John to John Mercer Langston Highway the first president of the Respect. what is now Virginia State University. Respect! Let's go, Trojans. Let's go. V-A-U-A. That's, um, That's because... That's real, though. It's, I'm already paranoid enough about police. Now I got to be paranoid about police and ride on Robert E. Lee, the right. Confederate highway. Like, uh, yeah. Ain't so nobody yeah. trying to ride on no slave on the highway. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nope. I'm all right on that. Maybe ride over a slave owner or <laughs> <laughs> but not on their hop. Take you this, know? mister. You no, know, ride a steamroller through the plantation uh mansion or whatever. <laughs> but can yeah. lay it up. <laughs> yeah, dang right. <laughs> dang right. <laughs> I know this one ain't on talking. You know, um, I used to work at Hardy's, right? And you know, to become a manager, you actually have to go, go down. I think it was in North Carolina, and train in a plantation. The building is a plantation. You can go through a schooling at a plantation. Mind you, this, this is the same, same company owned by the CEO that was under Trump's camp. What are you training camp. me to do at a plantation? Mm-hmm. Watch the other slaves. To work, nigga. <laughs> no, hell no. Exactly. That bitch and burn it down. Burn it down. You know, my Django shit. Yeah, that shit mm -hmm. the candy man, people. Hey, people, get out. Get out like the Jordan Peele movie. Get out. Get me out. And Snap the picture. Peele, speaking of Jordan Peele, he got a new horror movie out coming. Well, he ain't out yet, but it's coming. Oh, real, it's really him? It ain't that Karen it's type really shit, him. is it again? Like it's it's real really knock him. Off. It's really okay. him. <laughs> you want to know uh -huh. how I know it, it's really him? Because Jordan Peele has movies, and they have the most 
regular words for the name of the movie. Got Get Out. Yeah. Us. Yeah. Them. You want to know what this one's called? Of course you do. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you guessed it. Nope. That's the name. Nope. nope. Like nope. the uh, like the internet meme where they be some some some. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if that's what inspired nope. them, but I. I, I think I know where the feelings come from. If I was in a horror movie and then, and um, Fred uh, from the Scooby-Doo gang says, hey, man, I think we should go investigate. Guess what? You I'm want some of this old man? Nope. 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 <laughs> <laughs> this going to be a movie about all the black people just sitting at home because all the way, they going to be watching the news the whole episode. Oh, damn, man, they done killed all our friends. What happened? Uh, we told them don't go. <laughs> the end. <laughs> the quickest, go. quickest horror movie ever. Yeah. <laughs> quickest, <laughs> quickest horror movie ever. The last, the last scene of the movie going to be the white people walking out the door. Hey, man, y'all really ain't coming? Nope. <laughs> Roll <laughs> credits. <laughs> They're going to call that shit avant-garde. That whole movie going to be 30 seconds. And then and then a nerd to have end credits at the end. <laughs> when they're gonna be long as hell. <laughs> For our production team in Toronto. <laughs> Coming 2024. 20, <coughs> Ain't but seven the people sequel. in the whole movie, and six of them <laughs> leave <laughs> as the black <laughs> man just says. Nope. <laughs> Shut the door. <laughs> and the sequel coming out in four more years. You wanna know what it's called? Hell no. That's the name of it. <laughs> <laughs> the, the title get longer as you go. <laughs> the fifth the fifth one will be called. I ain't fucking with it. <laughs> <laughs> the old the old man with the hat that was singing hell no. Nah. He's gonna be the sound, he's gonna be the dude. Hell no nah, to the no no no. Hell no. <laughs> Oh, hell oh, no. Uh-huh. This is my shit at the cookout. You said what? This is my shit at the cookout. <laughs> what DJ playing that at your cookout? I can, see, I, can see, I can see face in there with them cowboy boots and a, and a black, a black <laughs> Stetson just sitting there tapping his foot. Hell no. Hell no. That's your asshole. Y'all don't know. This my shit. Yeah, you know, I never heard that shit a hole in the wall. That's my shit too. Why well, I feel like I heard that before. I never heard that. How <laughs> it go? Like here, here go. I don't know the top of my head. I know it's about the hole in the wall. Google this I'm shit. Gonna have to YouTube it. I'm gonna YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, YouTube that shit. That's my shit too. That shit slap. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, man. Oh here. Hey. Uh, <laughs> There <laughs> we go. Oh, man. Oh, man, face. <laughs> I mean that, yo. I don't even know what the hole in the wall. <laughs> Sorry, man. That's what I say, yo. Sound like some shit they only play at speakeasies and juke joints. All I listen <laughs> to go or look up on YouTube, hole in the wall, or the other shit they said, hell no. Them shit slap, man. Nah, hell no, yeah. yeah hell no, no, no. That's almost hell a Negro no. spiritual. No, no, no. No, hell no. It's dang near a Negro spiritual. Wait a minute. Speaking mm-hmm. of Negro spirituals, all right. Uh, the, NBA, uh, the NFL said they're going to do the Black National Anthem. From that on, that's that's what I heard, and I and I'm thinking to myself, is this what Jay Z is doing? Is this what Jay Z is doing? <laughs> so yeah, the black national anthem. See, I have all right, okay. To, uh, uh, all right, all right. I like the gesture, but yeah, I. Do they know why? It ain't about the anthem. It ain't about the music of the anthem for real. Like, we already know that shit racist, but that ain't really what it's about. It's about the police brutality and the 
and the systematic racism and injustice that black people face. That's what it's about. Give us do something. Stop for, giving them these you want to do, some, do something? Do something with your clout, power, and money, NFL, and do something to do to put pressure on a politician or something to help change that. We don't need no that. We can listen to the damn Black National Anthem on our own. Like we don't need you for that. We can put some fucking AirPods in if we want to play football. And, and not every time you go to church. Um, <laughs> Black History like, Month, they play. That's that's the same yeah. shit as like making June to the holiday. Like that ain't what we want. It ain't like it's cool. Mm-hmm. But that ain't. Mm-hmm. It's like it's like I'm. It's like I've been. You've been starving me all week. I literally have not had nothing to eat, and then you come by and ask me, "Do I want to go play?" It's a nice gesture. I understand you wanting to know if I want exercise, but I need food. I, I, that ain't what I need. So I that, that ain't got nothing to do with the, pro, the, actual, the actual problem is I'm starving. It ain't that I, I ain't have access to a playground. It's I'm starving. Like, <laughs> the fuck? Well, I have a take. It's completely off. Completely different. I, once again, I, as I've been saying, I totally agree with the statement that Tiz has said. And I don't disagree at all. This is my other reason why I'm not really for, you know, the Negro National Anthem being played. Um, now, mind you, I'm not even a real big sports fan or whatever, but I know how I am when I want to hurry up and see or do what I want to do. <laughs> oh, and uh, let me tell you, uh, the up. Negro National Anthem, <laughs> it's one of the longest songs. If y'all want, that's not going to help black and white relationships. That's going to piss white people off. Look, you 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 already seen Gary Owens talk about going to every time church. you think it's over, that shit go. <laughs> you be like, hey, sing a song. And <laughs> I, like, damn, we I, have been singing maybe, a song for hours. Maybe the first game of the season. I might actually want to see it because I want to see how distraught white people faces are when they when it's like 10 minutes in and we're still singing the middle part of the song. Mm. <laughs> I, I just want to see that at one good time. All right, you, you see how long it's taking? Show you what it's for like. Us, we go to church. But for us to end this song. You see how long it's taking? That's yes. why we'll never see y'all at the restaurants after church because y'all be catching brunch and breakfast. Mm-hmm. My ass come in there. It's the dinner menu. You see how long this song is? That's how long it's been to get justice from y'all motherfuckers. You're going to have to suffer. But Every like Sunday. I said, like I said, I know how I am when I want to hurry up and get to something. It's not going to improve yeah. black and white relations. I'm can you, can tell you, you see the uh, Super Bowl? How long it's going to take for the Super Bowl to start now? That oh, shit already like a 30, 40 minute production to get to the game. Yeah. <laughs> they not, they, they, that ain't going to go through. They ain't going to have that. Boy, they, when they, they have go. Beyonce come up there and sing and she want to oh, riff and, and stretch the note and, and go yeah. for the high note and try to outdo Whitney and Oh Lord, that shit gonna be long as hell. Let me let me tell you how long. <laughs> let me tell you how long Negro National Anthem is. All right, when 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 they first started doing Black History, it was called Black History Week. That's how long the Negro National Anthem is. The whole first Black History Week or whatever. When Black people start singing it, <laughs> let me tell you how long it gets. It's about as long as Black History Month. Now, <laughs> now, have you have, have you ever been have you ever been to a black church? All right, all right, yes, all right. You you know how it takes a whole day. All right, that's the first verse of the black of the black Negro national anthem. All right, so yeah, yeah, y'all might want to rethink that. Y'all might go remix it. You know, chop it up. You know, make it. You know. Yeah. Make it it's gonna be longer than two minutes. It's gonna take you long, know because they gonna always have some black lady singing it, and black people we put emphasis on our shit. We be oofing. We gonna go mm-hmm. for the gusto because we gonna feel that shit, especially the first time they sing it. Oh man, whoever do that first performance of it, it mm-hmm. gonna lose they mind. They gonna be up there crying and shit. It's I don't want it to be the whole a- thing. You you know what? I don't even really want it to be a black person. I want it to be a white person. I want them to suffer through it. 
Like, no. <laughs> I don't want to no. hear it. But no. I just I don't wanna, know how you I like your bricks, up. but I don't like mine like that. What I'm not gonna do is have no no agent no, singing me the work. Negro national anthem. That shit do not go. Look, man, everything, everything ain't for everybody, man. Everything I, don't I, I'm being dead. selfish. Hey, man. I'm being selfish, yeah, and I, I just. Man. When the I last time you when the last time you seen uh China let somebody come that's black come sing their national anthem to start off some sporting event? True. I ain't never seen it. I never heard of it. I ain't never watched no Chinese. Yet. <laughs> I know. So, yeah. I, I just wanted to, I just wanted some more content for the good and fuckery in the future. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we gonna laugh at it if it happens. Oh yes, yeah, we're gonna talk some shit. Oh, we're gonna talk some shit about it, but I'd rather not see it. Let's get back to the culture. Nah. So let's let I'm gonna fly through these. Um, so Blade, um, Tiz, help me out with the dude name. Um, Mahershala. Mahershala Ali. Mahershala Ali. All right, as y'all know, he's the new Blade, and they now got um Helmer Basam Tariq. As the director, um, he's a uh, Elmo Basama Tariq. Yeah, that's a long name, right? Yeah, I was I'm like, okay, well, who? I thought he was saying got, the name um, of a law firm or something. Elmo La Fala Tariq and Associates. No, Mama said my mom and I who saw. Ali, 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 Ali. I'm gonna say it one more time. I'm not gonna stop. I'm gonna say it one more time. I'm not gonna stop. I'm gonna say it one more time. I'm not gonna stop. I'm gonna say it one more time. I'm not gonna stop. Come on. <laughs> I still don't believe. It. I still don't believe that's what he said. Well, thank you, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I know. I know. We just know. niggas, man. We don't want it to be. We want it to be some old mama say mama side. Oh, <laughs> some shit they get. Some shit don't make no sense to nobody nowhere. Mama say mama side. Turn it up. <laughs> All right, I'm going to end the movie news with this. Um, uh, Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, and Swiss Beat Sons are coming together to for a, a movie named Charge It to the Game. That kind of sounds like an old No Limit movie from back in the day. Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> or old Hot Snoop. Boys. Or oh, uh, old Snoop Dogg No Limit album from back in the day. I tell you what, I definitely, I definitely feel like the DVD version gonna have a picture on it with the wording is all in diamonds and gold. It should. They're gonna have some pit bulls and a mansion in the back. It should. <laughs> oh, my question, I don't know if you know the answer or not. My question is, do these guys have any acting backgrounds or are they just coming up because they're, they're sons of people they want to just try to act? Yeah, it sounds like some son shit because I ain't never heard of them. I believe they're sons because this is the first time I even heard of Snoop Dogg's uh, son's name. Yeah, hey, I don't even know which son that is. I know the one that played football, and then there was another one that did something. But I think Dr. Like Dre. No, I, might, I might be confusing. I might be confusing Dr. Dre's son with um, Ice Cube's son. So yeah, Ice Cube's son. Now I know he did good, and he was in the uh, NWA movie. He did good at acting. Like I could see him doing something. He did a few movies. Yeah, but the other these mm-hmm. other cats. Uh, nah, we don't know. No, no, no. It gives me no limit. It's that money vibe. talk shit right here. I got money yeah, for my son or something. And if it turns out like we will have jokes. Mm-hmm. So it gives me that um choices from hypnotized minds movie vibes. Yes. Look that's that. a that's a very apropos Classic. uh <laughs> the comparison Classic. answer. Classic. Yeah. Um, all right, so let me get right down to it. Um, get down to it. Uh, once again, Meg the Stallion is 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 winning, it's just winning, it's just winning. It's just winning. Um, he just yeah, like her yeah, knees, one, I don't give a damn about her winning. Yeah, it shouts out to Meg's knees, whatever they them, should have their own the Olympic patella and the meniscus. The, the things she do with those knees, man. The things she do with those <laughs> knees, people. Okay. 
<laughs> like artwork. Anyway, um, yeah, she becomes the first rap artist to appear on Sports Illustrated swimsuit cover. Because what rapper in the 90s is going to end up in a swimsuit cover? <laughs> yeah, That's hopefully it. not. Hopefully it will be like just either Lil Kim, Lil Kim Foxy. Foxy. That's yeah. about it. And Eve. Yeah, yeah, yeah maybe. 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 It ain't going to be no Queen Latifah. I seen them things nah. in Be- when she was in Bessie. <laughs> that ain't going to do it. <laughs> that is not gonna do it. No ma'am. No ma'am. <laughs> Bessie ruined everything. Whatever the whatever the uh mystique was there. MC Light. No Lord. Man, MC Light too. <laughs> I gotta nope, I ain't gonna do it. I ain't gonna do it. Nope, 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 damn ho, here we go. Nope, 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 nope. You, you, your face tried to set me up there. You know what he was doing. I, it's something there. It's, it's something there. And my people out there know you know. My people with that comedic mind like mine, you know what a joke is there, but I'm going to leave it alone. Hi, <laughs> huh? damn. Well, here we go again. <laughs> Boy, uh... <laughs> oh, Let me go to the next subject before we get in trouble. All right. Yeah, I would get canceled. All right. Um, enter, in the, in the, enter. <laughs> in the um, intergalactic race to see who has the most money, Jeff Bezos has stepped up into the game um, okay. with his Dr. Evil looking rocket that he's going to be in to shoot off into space. Yeah, that rocket was uh, very uh, yeah. dildo-ish. Yeah, very much so. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Both very different. Dr. Evil um, and Jeff Meso, which is funny because he's bald-headed. And yeah, I would like to give a special shout out to all the people he has enslaved in Amazon because they paid for that trip to wherever he's going in space. Makes sense. Yeah. yeah, and um, and um, uh, but he really didn't go to space. Y'all, y'all see the I just want to make sure we say that though. What you said? What he didn't really go to space. Yeah, he kind of went to you know lower atmosphere. orbit atmosphere area. He it was like a sub. It was in a suborbital area. He was in the clouds, in the in the in the where the last cloud. Let's just call it what it is, man. He put a dick in the sky. That's about all he did. Yeah, he pretty much did. Fuck the sky up. <laughs> <laughs> Can't fuck, fuck the world up. up. <clears throat> Y'all already don't fuck the world up. Might as well go for the sky. Hey, sky's the limit, and you know we got. All right, I'm gonna stop. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, boy. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Look at this bus. I was one twelve. <laughs> 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 oh, done. I am. So this is for my who said Ashy the classy and uh, speaking of speaking of warehouse wor- workers, um, in the fuckery part of this, um, f- people workers in Frito Lay, they are requesting uh, the world to basically ban Doritos because. They're going through suicide shifts, pretty much. They say um, hundreds of Frito-Lay workers in Topeka, Kansas, are in a third week of a strike, citing so uh, what they call suicide shifts and poor working conditions at the manufacturing and distributing uh, distribution plant at a time when the company's net revenue growth was has exceeded all of its targets. <clears throat> Employees say sweltering 90-degree temperatures on the picket line are preferably uh, by better off than the 100 degree plus heat that's awaiting for them in the warehouse and the mandatory overtime that 84 hours a week, pretty much. Plus, they're saying that the racist is not matching the living, um, the cost of living increases, pretty much. So um, put them cooler ranch down. Put them cooler ranch down. <clears throat> So these people can get some a- AC, you know, but every chip 
that you eat, <laughs> that is another drop of sweat on one of these workers. That I make now it, it makes you really think about them Fritos, huh? Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's the face they be having when they be packing them. Why would you want a sweaty worker over your chips? Come on, that's son. not salsa. Hey, that's hey, not, hey, hey, that's not the salt I want on my chips. Hey, Playboy. Hey, hey. Okay. Yeah, I know it's a little, little bit out there. Okay, yeah. so <clears throat> to talk, you just talking about sweaty workers. I don't want to talk about no sweaty workers. I don't want to talk I about sweaty workers. I don't, I don't, I don't want sweaty workers sweaty. around my chips. <laughs> I definitely don't want to. I definitely don't want that. No sir. Come on, give them some AC, man. Yeah, this all sounds just pretty bad. They they said, um, well, we got a um we got a shortage on salt, so let's just pump the heat up to a hundred. <laughs> let's pump the heat up to a hundred and just use salt from the sweat of the workers. Well, let's sprinkle some crack on them and get out of here. Yeah, that's exactly what they say. <laughs> <laughs> just sprinkle a little crack on them. All right. <laughs> This is hilarious. All right. So the top <laughs> off the fuckery for this week. This is the fuckery of all fuckeries here. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Lorraine Graves of Tulsa, Oklahoma. She just happened to be scrolling along on Facebook and noticed the wanted poster for her arrest and, um, and went on that wanted poster and commented it. So if she can get received the reward for turning herself in. Oh no. Oh no. You yeah. jackass. <clears throat> yeah. I hope they put her right up under the jail. Nope. Yeah, right Nowhere up near under, right, right up under. Right up under. Mm-hmm. Right the hell up under. Yeah. That's just stupid. Yeah, that is. Like, but so that's not the mother, that's mother, not the first what? time I've seen that. That is not the first time I've seen that. And these police Facebooks have been posting up pictures. I seen one guy. He actually was having a conversation, planning the time that he was going to actually come in and uh, turn himself in. And then they comment back, "Hey guy, hey, we missed you the other day." And he was like, "Oh, my my schedule got a little tight. I'm trying to wrap up things before I come in." Um, I will make sure that I make make it there tomorrow <laughs> afternoon tops. I'm like, y'all just, just sir. That's today. You you yeah. mean today? That's what you mean. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, not tomorrow. Today. He actually he actually took a picture of himself. Actually turned himself in at that. When I find, I'm gonna have to. I have to go through my, um, <laughs> my long line of. Sp- Posts on my Facebook to find it, but man, yeah, it, this, these things are happening. And um, oh, yeah, people are so dumb. Something in the water, man. That fluoride is killing folks. <laughs>